New at five, a true blast from the past today for one local member of the greatest generation. More than half a century later, a Korean War and Vietnam era veteran got to visit a modern day version of the type of ship he once commanded. 13 News Now military reporter Mike Gooding takes us there. 53 years after he last commanded a United States Navy destroyer, today a 94 year old Williamsburg man got to relive his dream right here aboard the USS Stout. His name is Dick Hanley, and for nine decades plus, he was amazingly agile getting up the ship's ladder and making his way onto the bridge. There, the retired commander received a briefing on the Arleigh Burke class guided missile destroyer's 21st century capabilities. Twas a far cry from what they had back in his day. Well, there really is hardly any way to make any comparison. Henley was CEO of a World War II era ship called the USS Storms DD-780. Aboard the Stout, he was impressed with what he saw and with who he met. I am very, very happy to have met all of them because everybody was, was very courteous, very respectful and, uh, you know, uh, and, and very accommodating. Today's visit, Hanley said, was kind of like getting a special Christmas present. You might look at it that way, absolutely. It's certainly been a gift to me to be here, yes. And the scout team was happy to host him. The XO says it was a treat. I think men that served uh, and women that served um, throughout history have a, a great, you know, lesson to learn to give to all of us as, as we struggle through where we're at in this Navy's time and the lessons they learned in their Navy's time. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now.